guys, I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favorite. Definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome into my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family. Just thank you so much for taking the time out for yourself, being able to work on you, uh, working on your goals and your blessings because many things are starting to come our way. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, please like and subscribe. You can hit that notification bell so you know when you're about to upload the next video. Also, if you're comfortable enough, please drop me a line or two. I love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me, even if it's about the positive feedback and content of my video, or you're just up to me about your impact and get how it impacts your life and you in a positive direction. Also, if you feel like the video is giving you good vibes, good information, you would love to share with a loved one, family, or friend, or even a fellow empath that are going through these really dark times right now, and they need validation and confirmation towards their life path, their soul purpose, or even their journey that they're heading towards, please go ahead and share. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and also share in the social media favorites wherever you see fit. Thank you once again for the love and support that you've been giving me and showing my channel. It's so really appreciated, and I love y'all from the bottom of my heart. And I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. Um, today I'm listening to uh, manifest anything you desire. Law of attraction, meditation, music, asking the universe. And I will post that link in the description box below. And today my video is about 2020 101. Hey, Opus, the shifts you are currently experiencing will help you with your personal growth. It is. I mean, sometimes it's hard to understand what you're going through at times when stuff seems to be stressed out. You know, we don't take the time out to really see what's going on. We're concentrating more on the negative than the positive at times. It just depends, you know, whatever vibe is coming for your way. You know, I mean, especially with us being empaths, we we can be focused on one thing. And it's just like somebody else, it'll be a shift next to, you know, you're dealing with somebody else's uh, energy or it could have been something that triggered you. And it's like, you know, sometimes we don't understand the process that we got to go through until we really like dive deep and really look at things for what they truly are. You know, go past the smoke screens, you know, because it's just like when you're so focused on you know, uh, the negative or the problems that you're having. It's hard to see the blessings in front of you at times. You know, I've done it myself. You know, there's times that, you know, uh, I might be heading towards something and I'm trying to plan stuff out with my life. And it's just so many things that keeps coming up back to back to back to back to back. And it's like all these shifts in, um, that are happening for us is for a positive purpose. It's for a positive reading. It's like lately I've been on one-on-ones. And I mean, my love bugs have been going through it. I'm just like, you know, we're all going through it. You know, if it's not messing with our, our health, it's messing with our mental, our mental health, uh, our self-esteem. You know, have doubting stuff, you know, and it's really not what it's supposed to be doing. It's like, you know, these things are going on, but it's having you, like, it's like a filter. Like, you know, when you have a regular filter, you're putting all that water in there and it has all the minerals and, you know, God only knows what comes out of that pipe. Those pipes and stuff like that. But when you have that filter, is supposed to clean everything out so you can get that pure water. And that's basically what is going on with our lives. We're going through so many different filters. We're going through so many different recycles. You know, we have to go through things to get to it. You know, um, we, you know, reoccurring memories that, you know, we're trying to break away from. Things that are probably we, uh, lost in our subconscious or even things that we have suppressed. Um might be reoccurring in your life that you you know you need to part ways with so it's like everything you're going through it has a positive purpose behind it you know if you really truly look at it because i mean it took me a minute to actually see that as well because i get so worried at times i'm like oh i'm good today is it gonna be like this tomorrow <laughs> you know because you never know you never know because we're going through so much at one time where you know we're wondering when is universe going to stop having us go through all these changes when will I be able to, you know, get through this? You know, but it's just, it, it depends on how much stuff you have been through, how much stuff you're still holding in, how many things you still haven't healed from. So it's going to have you going through all these things. And it's just like, you know, when you're coming towards the end of your road, it's that 444 when I said that. When you're coming towards the end of your road, 
um, you're going to go through a lot of major trials and tribulations. It's always like that when you're about to have a big turnaround. And it's like, you don't even know what's going on for you. It might not even be the things that you're praying for. It might be another blessing that's coming in. You still got to wait. So with all these different things, you you know, you're you're feeling, you're dealing with, you have to be able to take that time out for yourself. You know, a lot of people are like separating, ghosting people. You know, I haven't really been talking to nobody lately. You know, I just, you know, send people the love and light. You know, if I got a vision, I don't know if somebody watched my videos and um, at that time. And like, if it's like a one-on-one, -on -one, I let them know, hey, you know, I got a vision about this, this, and this, and that. And it's like two or three people like, Rosa, you right on point with me because this has all been happening to me. And that's all. You know, because it was like a shocker when I sat up here envisioning Mother Earth giving birth to a universe, a whole new world, because it's like eliminating people out, you know, having the people that have been activated, you know, up and center, you know, just basically going through hell, going through a lot of hell just for you to be able to get through everything, but it's just going to put you on a level that you never dreamed of even going to. So it's just helping you get to that next level of your spiritual growth, getting closer to the ultimate higher self. So all these things are like a process that we truly need to go through. You know, there's times, you know, I, I can sit up here and I know something's going on because I get spaced out from it. And I'm like, what were you saying? <laughs> you know, you get spaced out. You know, you, you can be concentrating on something. You're having different daydreams that's basically mimicking the things that you want towards your life. You know your dreams are just all all crazy and then you gotta go look them up just see what the heck is going on because your dreams could be coming at you all crazy sometimes they'll wake you up and you're like the heck was that so it's just like all these different things you're going through is supposed to be for a positive outcome a positive pro process you know it might be very stressful and overwhelming this is something we really have to go through and we'll be benefiting it you know it'll be benefiting us in so many different ways so many different directions and you got to trust that process and it's like these things is going to be able to take us towards where we truly want to be because I don't know what the heck is going on other than, but I know it's something more that's going on, just not just with Mother Earth giving birth, you know, because it was like a week ago, it was like a ascension process, it might stop for some people, but it just depends on how much stuff you're still holding within yourself, you know, your heart chakra might be messed up, you might, you might feel like you have panic attacks or you can't breathe. You know, it can be really heavy. You know, you could even have really heavy energy at that time, you know. And it's just like you have to be able to take that time out for yourself to do self-care. You know, do that soul strengthening that, you know, universe is hard for you to do. It's like today, I wasn't even about to make any videos. You know, I told universe, I'm tired. I just want to lay down and, you know, just do, do me for me. But then it was just like I started going through so many things today. And I just had me a good cry. And then all of a sudden, you know, I just meditated and asked God, is there any kind of content for our universe source? You know, is there any content you need me to put out today? It's like, yes, you know, you're not the only one going through this. You know, um, make these videos about this and that. I'm like, okay. So it's just like these little words will come popping up in my head or I'll see something and they're like, hey, that's what we want you to talk about. So all these things that we're going through, you know, we, we're getting tired of these shifts. I know you are. <laughs> going through these ascension phases i told you my, my rash is getting worse like you know i can't really put anything on it and i know it's like a come and go i know it's just like a lot of things purging out my body uh, i went through this after i finished smoking like a few months ago like this happened in like december january it got really bad but it's like i haven't smoked it over six months so you know it's probably just nerves because all the stuff that i've been through it, it was a lot you know because there's a lot of times i hold in a lot of things too as well that i'm currently going through so you know we have to just be able to trust that process you know it, it just it, it might be painful but it'll benefit you in the long run so have faith in yourself knowing that you will get through this um healing yourself in different ways being able to see things for what they truly are you know if there's people getting taken out your life or people are separating from you or you're starting to feel offish towards certain people that's basically telling you to break that chain you know if it's meant for you it'll come back so um when you start your intuition starts kicking in on hyperdrive and they're telling you hey you need to cut this person out your life or hey just leave back that person off or just give yourself that time for you excuse me take heed for that so that's that this is that time for you to work on you because i know there's a lot of people 
you know, that I love to talk on one on one with, but we're all on our soul mission right now. You know, it's okay to, you know, communicate, you know, when you got that downtime, but when they're telling you you need to work on you and there's so many de- different, you know, energies is coming up, filters is coming up, and you're feeling, you know, your, your emotions are all over the place. You don't need to be talking to nobody anyway because you can spread that, that energy off to yourself, um, to other people. You definitely don't want, you know, them bringing their, their issues with you. So, um, I hope that you were able to resonate with the content of my video. Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell. Drop me a line and let me know how you feel about this. Are you currently going through different shifts and, and it has you going through, you know, all those hard times. But trust and believe it's going to benefit you in the long run. You're going to be happy when all this stuff is over. When you're looking at it in a different light. So, I'm going to give a um, post notification shout out to Brittany Wick and Quan Bradley and um jay Cotwright, much love to you as well and i will talk to you on my video on my next video i hope that you are truly blessed highly favored forever loved and knowing there's always someone out there praying for your better days i pray for y'all each and every day and i love y'all from the bottom of my heart and sound as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can and know we will get through this crazy process and i'll see you on my next video much love to you peace be wild